and look who we have stopping by. It is Kentucky guard Rob Dillingham. Thank you so much for taking some time out of your schedule to be here with us on NBA Today. For sure. Thank you, Malika. I How am so excited. I am doing really well. I love to do these interviews because I don't want to waste any time. You're here today to share some really special news with us. So the floor is yours. Uh, with the help of my team, my longtime manager, Rico Greer, I've decided to sign with Clutch and enter my name in it. 2024 NBA draft. Wow, congratulations entering your name into the 2024 NBA draft. This is, it's such an exciting time, as you mentioned, signing with Clutch. I know you're already getting underway with all of your workouts. So, so let's talk a little bit about the NBA draft because we just saw a couple of your highlights, a couple of, of moves that we could see in the NBA as well. But last year, I feel like there really was, there was a consensus number one pick in Victor Wembanyama. And this year at the top, it, it's sort of wide open. So Make your case. What, what are teams getting when they draft you? Uh, I feel like teams are just getting an overall complete person yeah. and, like, a good player who can uplift others because, like, I feel like at Kentucky, coaches taught me it's not about me and it's about winning and helping your teammates learn each other. So uh, really just an all-around player and whatever the coach needs me to do, I feel like I can do. And that, that's such an important thing, especially as a, a young player coming into the NBA. There's always an adjustment period. We've seen it time and time again. But let's talk a little bit about the San Antonio Spurs because they're going to get a high draft pick. We don't know what it is exactly yet. What, what do you think watching someone like Victor Wembanyama play, what would it like to be play, like playing alongside him? Uh, I mean, it would be amazing because yeah. there's nothing he can't do. So playing with him, it's like... If he has the ball in his hands, two people got to guard him. So, <laughs> right. um, really playing with the whole team and uh, learning from Popovich, uh, the whole team, and playing with Wimby, I feel like it would be an amazing opportunity for sure. I know that you are at this point just looking at whatever opportunity comes. I know you're going to be ready for it. But I am curious if players, you know, young players, college players, as you were looking at, at someone like Victor, if, you're, if, if you were paying attention like the NBA world was. Right. Uh, yeah, I was definitely paying attention. Yeah. Uh, at first, it was they were trying to say it wasn't. It was hard for him, and then he <laughs> started the season playing amazing, shooting over 40 from the three. He literally can do everything at 40 and 20. So. Uh, I think he's amazing. For sure. Let's talk a little bit about you. I know you are a scorer. You came off the bench largely for Kentucky. But what do you think? Who do you model your game after? Uh, I really take after all of my favorite players. Yeah. Uh, my favorite point guard back then was Steve Nash. I used to watch Steve Nash. But uh, also nowadays Kyrie Irving, Darius mm. Garland, uh, Tony Parker, a lot of players for sure. So. Um, I just try to be the best I can be. Something that I love as we kind of approach every June is that this is the time of year that we get to see players' dreams come true. And it, it never gets old for me, sitting in that seat, watching it over and over again. Have you, have you thought about maybe who you want to share that moment with, how you want to spend your first NBA check, who's going to be in the green room with you? Uh, definitely uh, my mom, yeah. my brother, my dad, sister, uh, Rico, for sure. So. Uh, I'm not sure yet, but uh, I definitely want to help my mom for sure, my sister, her kids. So That's really wonderful. It's a, it's a whole family affair, and that's really what this is all about. Congratulations again, Rob, declaring for the 2024 NBA draft. Good luck this year. Thank you so much.